So I want to do politics, but I'm not only going to do politics because I pioneered the phrase, I coined the phrase when I was on this station, KSFO, by the way, locally, back in the early days of the 90s of I do news, views, and reviews. <clears throat> now, the station now uses the phrase news and views you won't hear anywhere else, which is true. But I add to it news, views, and reviews that you won't hear anywhere else. And you know what I want to review today? A TV movie I saw last night. That Like, I, I search, I search after a show. Last night after the show, for example, I couldn't just go to sleep. I, who could go to sleep right now? The adrenaline is through the roof, so I need a beer to calm me, take me off the high wire, right? So I go to a local Italian restaurant. I don't go to San Francisco. I go to a local Italian restaurant, which will be un remain unnamed, and I get a simple meal. I got a pasta with, with uh, a tomato sauce. You know, I didn't want to. I was dying to eat the meat. Oh, man, I had the rigatoni with meat sauce last week. I almost died. It brought me back to all the heart attack food I grew up on. I loved it. But I only, you know, maybe once every few months I do the heart attack uh, dance. You know, but I'm not. So I had the, the veg. It was pretty good. And I ordered a beer. My luck, my luck in this restaurant, which has been in the area for 50, 100 years, 60 years. My luck, I get a waiter who just moved here from New Jersey. A Jewish guy in his 70s who told me his life story within three minutes. I said, oh, my God. No matter how far I go, I'm back at Katz's Delicatessen in my youth. It plagues me. I'm back. Up. He was a nice guy, but I, I was tired. I didn't want to hear it. I wanted the beer and the spaghetti. Till I got the beer, I already learned that he just moved out here and that he worked for his brother-in-law's his sister's restaurant for 22 years. So I said, wait a minute. Why are you here? What brings you to the San Francisco area? I mean, you're like a fish out of water here. He said, don't ask. He said, 22 years I worked for my sister and my brother-in-law. He said, do you think they gave me one free meal once in those 22 years? I swear to God, I'm not making this up. So I said to myself, you know, wherever I turn, there's a show topic. Who ever heard of a waiter working in a sister's restaurant and not being given a free meal? I couldn't believe it. I wanted to buy the guy a free meal when I heard that. I'll be right back. It's the Savage Nation. Call Michael right now at 855-400-SAVAGE. That's 855-400-SAVAGE. 400 7282. So